like the goal the goal is just to like try things out see what works what doesn't so the idea is that our character is like fairly fast so we have like some sort of medium weight body but we have good boosters good generators we have like a variety of different weapons we have a winning condition but if we get rushed down by zimmers it's difficult all right let's see what this guy got What I think I'm going to be doing today is like, we're probably going to do like three matches for each build and then we're going to try a new one. So we're just basically going to experiment a little bit. <laughs> Didn't mean to do that. Interesting. Dude, we're doing well so far. Look at that. Look at that, dude. Our build's actually working out so well. Dude, it was not even close, dude. We actually made a build that's like fairly good ranged and it's like kind of balanced a little bit. Man, I might make more variation of this. I haven't played really much with this. So I'm like trying it out, see how I like it. But like, I like the theory craft. Oh, this is gonna be a trade. He's going down, so we do the bazooka. Oh, we missed. Dude, it's actually, it's actually pretty good. good there. Oh, that's it. Oh, the armor saved him. Dude, this is actually working out so well. What the hell? I, I love this thing, man. I'm thinking uh, we should give like people like two matches each just for the sake of variety because I'm gonna upload these after. Like just give people the two matches so they can get the salty run back and then uh, you know just mix it up after that because uh, when I'm playing not for content I don't mind say staying like as long as I as I want but I feel like it might get boring to always fight the same op opponent for viewers so. I think like two matches per person is probably appropriate. You know, if they win one, if they win the first or the second, doesn't matter. You know, we're we're trying, we're just trying things out. Well, here you go. We're fighting Meta. That even has like the Joker's team color. You guys think we can take that on though, dude? If we can take on like double shotgun with this, that would be kind of cool. D depends on how fast he is. If he uses the assault boost too. Yeah, it's gonna be d it's gonna be rough.
Can't do that. Oh my god, it's actually working so well. I mean, it's definitely, I feel like I have to put a lot more effort than he does, but still. Freaking, oh my god, dude. We, <laughs> we actually did it. We made the working like range build. God damn, dude. Should try making a needle build. Come on, man. Like everyone has that. And I have that. All right, let's, let's give him the salty road, uh, run back. Let's see what he brings. You have a favorite build at the moment? Yes. My, uh, my quadruple shotgun build is unmatched, I would say. Actually, it's matched by tanks. You know, if you make a really good tank, you can match it. Oh, shit. He brought out the double needle. So he went even more meta. <laughs> KB, thank you so much for the five gifted sub. Let's see if we can beat him with, with the most meta setup. With our freaking Frankenstein build that has a bit of everything. Still there. This is a bad play. God, this is such a good build, dude. Oh my god, I cannot believe this. I am shocked right now.
Dude. Absolute destruction, man. Get that meta out of here. Oh my god. Look at that. I am so proud. I'm actually so proud. <laughs> <laughs> what the hell? I am actually so proud of this. Okay, like we said, guys, every two or three match, we're gonna switch it up, try things out. Maybe we could do. Maybe we can do another one with this one. Come on now. Maybe maybe we can do another one. Let's do three match with this. <clears throat> bringing balance to the meta. I felt like we played that so well. <clears throat> I like the versatility that our build has, you know? Like, uh, we have, like, all types of weaponry. Like, we don't have, like, any weapon that's the same on each part. Yakim, thank you so much for the 10 gifted subs, man. Thank you so, so much. Dude, I'm actually so happy about our build here. You know, I, I think people would be able to find, like, counter strat to that. Oh, double Gatling and the things. Oh, man. I feel like we, we're having good tests. Good test to throw at it. Him. We flawless double Gatling stingers, dude. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh no, we took 10 damage. My bad. I mean, that's that's as much as a flawless as it gets, though. We literally took 10 damage. I just cancelled out my, my things because I want to find him first now. Probably hiding somewhere, but I don't want to commit like too hard. Let's at least get some altitude. Oh, see here? He played well.
Yeah, I feel like we didn't manage our range as well here. a bit worse like i mean we played a lot worse there but he played better as well dude i actually took some inspiration from uh from freud you know freud uh, let's take a look at his ac data if you take a look at freud he has the same weapons we have on the back um he has like but i feel like his main weapon are kind of a waste right like his main weapon is like a blade and a rifle just a normal rifle i'm not a big fan of that i feel like the blade is is something that definitely could fit something like this but you'd, you'd have to play a lot more differently like right here like because we have like a charge um plasma rifle and some missiles we can afford like because we have the missiles on our hand we can afford to have these on the back i feel like when they get a bit closer the shotgun bazooka or the spread bazooka is really good because it staggers them easily and does a lot of damage you you have the constant pressure with the drones and then long range you have that good old annoying like missile with the left hand and also you have like because you're you have so much downtime where you're not like in range you have more than enough time to charge uh something and i feel like the one that's easiest to land it's just a good old plasma like i know like charge it does like 1300 and you have like this like 1900 1007 2800 you know but like the thing is like if you look at the charge attack for these if you compare them like it's one blast let's take a look at it again but the others See, like, it's really just one blast, and it's it's all of them like that. Maybe this one could be good, though. Because this one has, like, a, a big explosion. This one could be interesting, the Coral Redshift. We could definitely try that. And then, same deal here. This one, I know, is, like, one, just one shot. But be I like this one because... Uh, the normal uh, attacks like without charging are good and then when you fully charge it it spreads uh, it spreads into three shot 